lymphedema is a buildup of extra fluid that can't be circulated out of the body. It's stuck in the interstitial space in the tissue, so it doesn't really get into one of the one of the veins or the the vessels to be reabsorbed by the body. Lymphedema can occur in really any extremity. With breast cancer, it's typically in the arm. Uh, sometimes it can kind of be a little bit in the breast and down the side of the body. The different treatments that are used in treating breast cancer can bring on lymphedema, such as surgery, radiation, anytime lymph nodes are removed from the system. The role of the lymph system is to help eliminate waste and help uh, cleanse the fluid that's in the body. Um, people that develop the lymphedema, a lot of times that's because they've had lymph nodes removed. So it's not able to drain as well. So it's like a clogged shower drain. So the fluid doesn't go through as well and you start getting a little bit of backup. There's still some drainage, but not fast enough for how much fluid is circulating through your body. Risk factors for developing lymphedema include number of lymph nodes that are removed during surgery, radiation to the area, and also obesity has been linked to an increased risk. It's better to find lymphedema early. The sooner it's treated, the sooner you get it back down to the normal size. The biggest thing to watch for with, with detecting lymphedema is any kind of changes that you feel to your arm. A lot of times the patient will feel a change in their arm before you even notice it on measurements. So it's just very important to bring it to your healthcare provider's attention if you're noticing either a heaviness or a fullness or a tightness of the skin.